Hello, Wary Wardens, this is Crimson, you are watching some Dragon Age Origins. Now, pick up where you left off, but we did everything we needed to at Ostagar. We got Kaelin, gave him a pyre, instead of doing something more fun and exciting, because, you know, there were only three options, they were all boring. <laughs> um, we got this nice staff we got here uh, from the mage's chest at Ostagar. There's a charred corpse near the start. You loot it, you get there, you bring in Liliana, unlock some chests, get some okay things. Um, Alistair... Even though we leveled everyone in the meantime, doesn't have enough strength to equip the Kaelin's armor yet. Got his shield on, though. I'm upset about that. Look at Sten. All nice up with his juggernaut armor on and the Eucerus great dragon slaying sword. Looking good, Sten. Looking good. Eliana can finally use that bow that I've been trying to equip her for so long and got her cunning up high enough so she can pick every lock ever. Win gave her a hat. And, you know, everyone's all equipped. They're, they're looking nice. We can talk to them, have a chat. I'd rather... I'm just gonna talk to Dog, though. Dog, how are you doing? Ah, oh, pet dog. Sits down and stares at you attentively. Rolls around happily on his back. He's so happy! He's so happy! And that makes me happy. Alright, let's have a little chat about that. Alistair, how you feeling? What do you need? You wanna talk about Duncan? You don't have to do that. I know you didn't know him as long as I did. Man. Uh, that's that's actually fantastic. He, he was uh, like a dad to you, wasn't he? I... I should have handled it better. Duncan warned me right from the beginning that this could happen. Any of us could die in battle. I shouldn't have lost it, not when so much is riding on us, not with the blight and... and everything. I'm sorry. You should be. I'd like to have a proper funeral for him. Maybe once this is all done, if we're still alive. I don't think he had any family to speak of. Man, you just don't care. He had you. <laughs> he had you. Which is like having less than nothing. I suppose he did. It probably sounds stupid, but part of me wishes I was with him. In the battle. I feel like I abandoned him. It's because you did. Yes. I know. I think he came from High Eber. Or so he said. Maybe I'll go up there sometime. See about putting up something in his honor. I don't know. Have you had someone close to you die? Not that I mean to pry, I'm just... I've lost enough. <laughs> yes, I imagine you really have, haven't you? Thank you. Really, I mean it. It was good to talk about it, at least a little. He, he, he was more my friend than yours, jerk. That's good to hear. It's nice to know I'm not the only one who remembers him well. Now, right, who wants to chat? Liliana, you know what? No, I don't want to talk to you, Lily. Wynn, you were just there with me. Irving told me about how you became a Grey Warden, and that unpleasant incident that occurred prior to your departure from the Circle. Ha! <laughs> I'm a blood mage now. I stand by the decision. Yes, I'm sure you do, and I respect that. Irving told me he was relieved Duncan was still willing to recruit you. But that aside, you're a Grey Warden now, and perhaps I presume too much by saying this. But the Circle is proud of you. We should kill those Templars and get them, uh, you know, back in line. Yeah. Yeah. You are a true child of the Circle. Raw power tempered with learning, wisdom, and the desire to serve others. Sometimes it gives me comfort to think that everything will end up the way it's supposed to. That it will be all right. You were chosen. You survived the joining when others did not. Perhaps it was meant to be. Well, I, I do have a deep down desire to serve others in dance battles. Y you got it right there. Shale, just just keep being Shale. Let's, let's get something done. How about that? Let's get out of here. Got a lot of combat. We went over a couple of things. You know, let's bring Shell. Yes, indeed. indeed. I'm sure all of these people care dearly for the warden thing I'm about to do. Um. Oh, I can't even. Ostagar is gone forever now. Is there more we could do here? Whatever. Let's go to other DLC land X. I'm gonna have to start bringing Win to get her plot points. Have I meet the condition for her plot points? I don't know. I don't know. Everyone's got some plot or another. And eventually, after I'm done messing around, I'll raise everyone's 
affection levels. We got the DLC, so we can just give them all cupcakes so they're happy with me. But there are plot items you can give them, like Morgan, and the book. Here we are, Soldier's Peak. Make us breath. Look at the size of her. What a fortress. I told you the map would get us through the tunnels. Just admit it. You were lost a couple of times. I wasn't lost. It's just that the map got soggy. Bah! We're here. So, I'll follow you about. From a distance. This place has the stench of death. I expect there's trouble up ahead. The map got Some soggy. Some people call this place the Lost Peak. Before King Merrick's decree, the last Grey Wardens of Ferelden lived here. <gasps> I just got chills. It's <laughs> probably because you're naked in the snow. Ah, she's gonna be talking. Morgan, shut her up, Chael. Like, feel free to crush her places. Any place you want. I'm not implying things by... Just, just hit her. It's just, Chael? Chael, come on, man. Okay, I... Come on, Golem. Nope. Fall back! Fall back already! Taking the peak will not be easy, my lord. I gave the Wardens one chance to die with honor. Instead, they hold up like cowards. We follow the King's advice, then. Starve them out. But the peak has months of supplies. Then we wait. When they are too weak to lift their weapons, we will send them to their final judgment. Man, that, they look kind of panicked when they were... What was that? Felt a bit woozy there. I'm not mad, am I? You saw it too. I've heard an Orlesian ballad about something like this. A beauty trapped in a dream. In the song, Belisa never wakes up. Your prissy friend here is making me nervous, Warden. How's this even possible? The place must truly be haunted. Just hit her, you know, if she ever makes you nervous. The veil is thin here, just like the tower. <laughs> the veil? Um, it's the dead land of where dead demons go. Demons? Thank Andraste you came, Warden. <sighs> After you. I want to make demon friends here. That's why Morgan's here, right? Demon friends? There's nothing to loot here. Hello, ghost. Um, do you like to... Oh. Ow. So combat's starting. Um, thank you. I tried to be merciful. For that lovely audio cue to turn things down very rapidly. Uh, our, our land corpse? Our land corpse. Oh, you know what? I need to check the guy's tactics here. We got our custom one. Alright. Archer. Is this good enough when being attacked in melee? Rapid shot, shattering, crippling, cri That's fine. That's fine. Let's make this quick. Oh, Morgan's okay, she hasn't moved in a while. I, I really need to get my next stuff. Look at this guy hitting me. Jeez, kind of forgot that Wind's not in the group anymore. That Shale can't tank for crap, even though I got Shale all picked out just to be a tank. It's fine. It's fine. Look at this guy just standing here. Like, huh. Looks like we're being attacked by zombies. I'll just stand here. Hey, okay, where are they coming from? Okay, that's a weird spot. No more fireballs for me. Oh, they have a cat. Ca Get over here, caster. Or, I don't know. All right, where are you? He's healing. Look at him healing. Bam. All right, no more of that. Yeah, throw staff stuff at me. I don't care. I am gonna run away here because I'm dying to death. Look at the healing sheep. Yeah, let's let's just get those archers not. Okay, they're, they're still in a perfectly fine same position. Fine! Do I have a potion that badly? I will. Man, this is even with my stuff up. Looks like Morgan finally got the spell off on him. Alright, there we go. Could you be done? Die? Whatever. We're good now? Can I regen my mana's back? No, of course I can't. But would you guys stop standing up? They're getting to be a real pain. We must fight. Let us do it. Oh, what Master Scout? That's a yellow name. Listen to these dead things in my ear hurts. Yeah, let's get him taken care of. Might slowly die here from being shanked. I'll be okay. Ow. That's just people have to stop. They'll stop hitting me eventually, right? Good to go. Now we get our 
Okay. Morgan's doing. Come on, Shane. It's one guy. Just make him stop hitting everyone else. I, 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 I will bring the dog back. Oh, Morgan died. They have a caster? Or is it just that the Master Scout? Is the Master Scout really that strong? I mean, I guess against Morgan. Well, she died fast. Alright, fine. Fine. Fireball it is. Look at Shale taking damage. Hey, champ. Another down. Yeah, I think we're getting it. And there aren't skeletal undead zombies like in my ear this time, so that's nice. We're good? Will they stop spawning around me? They can finish regenerating? It called. What, what are you? Precise striking? Threaten. Is that. There. Tank, please. What, what are your tactics, Shale? Aggressive. Defender. There. Do that. Warden Echo. And pennies. Or pennies. Statue. Hello, statue. Oh, do you talk like the other statue? Is that why I can click you? Ancient history. Codex. Oh, well. Boy, that's enlightening. How, how many words do you think that codex entry I just got was? You know, maybe maybe 200 ish? 200 words just right there? It's bam. Read it. They're like, no. Please, no. There's so many. Oh, look at how, like, now that I've thrown my once in a life antique warden crossbow. Who uses crossbows? Like, is there a crossbow build in this game? I mean, there's a character that they really want you to like in the second game that's going to be in the third game, I hear. That uses crossbows, although it's a named one the way they do items is terrible. Um, <laughs> let's, just, let's just stop. Let's just stop. Crossbows are bad. Willpower. It affects your mana and stamina. And then your blood Men's mage. Oh, hello. My spells are of no use in this matter, Commander. There is more to leading men than sorcery, Avernus. I will remind them that they're wardens. Men, I won't lie to you. The situation is grim. Our forces outnumbered, our bellies empty, and our hearts are sagging. But we are wardens. Darkspawn flee when they hear our horns. Archdemons die when they taste our blades. So are we to bend knee to a mere human despot? No! I, for one, will never give up! I, for one, will never surrender just to dance on Arlen's gallows. So I propose here and now, in these hallowed halls where generations of our brethren stood vigil against darkspawn and evil, that we send a message to that fat bastard. In this sacred place, proud men, strong men, stood defiant and would rather die than submit to tyranny. So brave, even when starving. And my great-great-grandmother stood with them. That was a nice speech. I liked it. I can't believe they attacked Grey Wardens, though. Why would they do that? Everyone knows they were banished. But to murder them like that, King Arlen must have been a monster. But I've gabbed enough. Lead on, my friend. Ah, oh, that speech. Ah, oh, that speech. Statement of defiance. Poster reads, on these ground virtuous men stood against the tyrant. They stood defiant and stood for freedom. And they died. Men? I just heard an awesome speech from a lady. It is signed by the Grey Warden defenders who were besieged by King Arlen's forces. Read the names of the fallen. Captain Melo, the Black Ferret, Chair Thrower Lopez, Sir Derek of Olay, and Jason the Longbow. Alan the Quibbler, Cartography Marta. Cartography Marta? Is that Cartography Marta? Whatever. David the Silent, Dustin the Colorblind, Ebinger of the Bovine Brethren, Pharrell the Pharrell, Sir Graham the Untiring, Jason sends the Argonauts, Jason minus the Argonauts, oh boy, Langley the Nefarious, Lucky Lucuna, L Lacuna, Mad Dog Smeadows, Matthias the Bloody, McGurk the Vile Priest, McGurk, 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 Melissa the Magical Maleficar, Ohm the 
the stretched. Okay. Home the stretched. And pack rat Dirksen. Dirksen? Dirksen. Sergeant Red Morrison. Sergeant Cribson. Santos the Silent Scimitar. Vitrolic Eric. Weak Eye Santos. And Wellburn the Exhaustive Fire. The Exhaustive Fire. Wellburn. Well, those were names. I like the guy whose name was Red. Our thing should be Red. Ow! Oh. Combat. Thank you. Let's let's go down a little more. He's gonna resist this. Oh, as he doesn't resist it. Okay, those are those are fire guys. Oh, I'll throw a fireball at him anyway. Wee! Are they fighting the arcane horde? No oh, whatever. I win. This was wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Indeed. We, we killed demons. No oh, demons here, though. And this guy's just levy. Just hanging out. Alright, empty room. What do you got for me? Skeletons who are going to crippling shot me. It shall be done. But I will take care of that. Commander! Oh no. Um. Shale? Shale help? I don't think we got this. Yeah, I think we'll be okay here. Oh, I didn't get frozen by Morgan this time. Thank you. I appreciate this. Like, I know he's asleep when I woke him up, but I got him. I got him. Shale, with, with Shale's tanking abilities activated, is really just the best, the strongest. Like, no challenge. If Shale actually used them properly. Oh, a chest that's locked. Bam. Max that out. Let's let's even let's even enjoy the glory. Is it skills and talents? Bam! There it is. The vice mastery maxed out. Level 12 rogue. Finally. Ah, uh, don't don't have much of anything else. We get arrow of slang and start working on uh, how to be an archer or maybe get the songs up. I don't know. I don't I don't like the bard songs. It's like as you say. What what enemy that wouldn't resist it anyway is worth taking one of my characters out of the fight for? You know. Note. A message from Soldier's Peak. A plea from the commander. I'm so hungry, give me food. Oh, I would just like to eat. I would just like to eat. Hunger is pretty crazy. Note. A uh, letter from Brian Midifwoof. I'm Midifwoof. Uh, I don't know why I joined the Grey Wardens. This king is silly. I miss my family. Live on, my family. My beard shall be with you in the afterlife. Well, that's good enough. Hey, wooden longsword. Wee, wee. As in, Bodan, make good money off this ancient relic, or uh, maybe I'll sell it to Levy. He'll he'll do more with it. I keep it. Oh, fire demons. Oh, that archivist. Well, let's um. All right, let's ice him first off. Okay, he's still doing stuff. You will Paralyze him. Beneath my foot. Beneath my foot. You go, Shale. Yeah, beat up this parallel. Yeah, look at Shale. See, now you're doing it right, Shale. I like this. I need to get behind this. Uh, we, well, I already killed the archivist demon, whatever that was. Whatever that was. No quarters shall be given. No quarters. Only nickels and dimes. The archivist's book. Nope. The book is badly burned. You can make out a word here and there, and that is all. The door won't hold, Archivist. Almost done. The, the truth must be told. What does it matter? We're dead. Our grand rebellion so close. And to die here, a, a stillbirth. We never should have done it. Wardens aren't supposed to oppose kings and princes. Should we stand idly by one? Oh. Another one. Rebellion? What's this about a rebellion? If only the book weren't burned. Maybe there are other records. We can only hope. That sounds interesting. The warden's That's rebelling against something. Oh, spirit shard. Thanks for that crap. Bowden will love it. Demon. Pennies. Why do demons have pennies? Book. The history of soldiers speak. It was stones in the mountain. It was built. And then it was unbuilt. They used people. To build it, believe it or not, and then people to unbuild it. I should not have entered this building looking at my time. Oh well. 
Oh, perfect. Well, this is a great scene. I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Thank you so much for watching. My hat, it's off to you.